Dark Destroyer is an awesome prospect. Almost knocked him with that. He led with the right, cracked him on the chin with it. And it's going to be all over by the shouting in the opening round. So just over a minute. Don't go away because Nigel Benn in the golden shorts has a habit of ending things very quickly. One five out of five, only had nine rounds. The last two opponents have lasted two minutes. And Leon Morris. I don't think he made 10 seconds. And this is a one round massacre. This is a bullying performance from Ben, but he's got a job to do and he'll do it until he's told to stop. He really is doing a destruction job here. And he's done him again with the left hook there. And the referee was going to go in and stop that. He's pulled him off and it's all over. In a big Andretti in Miami, he outpoints Jorge Amparo. Then the old power resurfaces against Jose Quinones. He's got him in trouble now. Nowhere to run on the ropes. He's really landed into him and follows it up through the ropes. And Richard Steele has got a dive. Now, I don't think Ben's going to let him off the hook. No. And he didn't. Doug DeWitt from Yonkers, New York, is the WBO middleweight champion. He's 28 and very tough. He won the title points against Robbie Sims, despite... Nigel Benn comes face to face with... Andretti's task is to improve his ring craft and maintain that awesome hitting power. He's never worked harder or... Well, of course, this fella's never lacked among the... WBO version. I know it's fighters don't care it's what sort of money they can draw. From his eyes, but that's the, the best possible start for Ben, the worst possible for DeWitt. Well, we thought it was going to be a rough fight and it turned out to be that way. I'll throw his best punches and get him in the right spot to knock this fellow over because he climbs up a lot, but he's hurt DeWitt. Of rounds. Yeah, what lifts him above most fighters is he's punching the champion, so I love him. Four as against 11-8 and a quarter, his last fight. A lot, and uh, Newman can see clearly the blood streaming down to win. to be towards the side of the eye. And uh, it's some battle already, isn't it? it had to be. All his management that he fancies, that he's always wanted to... Somewhat. Leaving his head up in the air so often, three by left hooks, and his corner didn't do this. And then he got in the inset there, the way they were working with. Well, he's catching him with his appropriately Sunday punches here, Ben. Oh, that he is, though. He takes him stopping. Yeah, but I don't think you can take too many of these punch good punches. Most of them are catching the a little bit high, but they're still good punches. And it's hot, and he's often taken a lot of stick early on. But the big form line in Ben's favour is that uh, the whip was stopped by Quinones, and Ben knocked. Ben comes back with a single. Ben, we know, can dip. Generally nagging him about what's the hedge doing the referee. Oh! Well, that, as I say, is a turn. Continued even if the bell went. Now, that was a shock. What a slugging match this has been now. Ben's been through this before, not only been marked with the power, it landed better. They both seem to throw the punch, there it goes. The was landed, bang on the chin, over went Ben, he started blazing back himself. See, there you go, they both threw a punch, the, although his weight was behind them. Yeah, but full blazing back once he got, but uh, his instincts, they got firing back. And that's given him something to think about. There, there goes the confident start. Pre-fight chat, they've got the show more or less good as me. I think Michael Watson might dispute that. To just do a little bit of boxing here, stay reasonable. First round, he just doesn't want to waste too much steam. Is it off? See, DeWitt is not a fellow you want to tire against, Reg. He's a good shot. Have, uh, the glory that Lloyd Hannigan had in this fight again, well, after that knockdown. He's favouring the, the left hook. I was going. Oh, he's down to that. He hangs whatsoever, Reg. And the round's nearly over, though. Punches after the bad amount of this. You look at the defence, Reg, non existent. Head up in the air. Really, a very poor attention to defensive, putting power into every punch. Lovely punch here. There he goes. Over, all over the place. 
And with a bit of a control fury now, Ben's got a really good shot of stopping this champion. There's nothing in DeWitt's jabs as they come back. DeWitt's going to have to find some power or he's in the way out, Reg. I think some of those tough fights are... I think some of these punches of Ben's have really taken some... Brave to the point of foolishness now, DeWitt. Just pouring with that left-hand punch. That's a good performance so far. doing that as you say he can't move he's rooted to the canvas too much but look at the carelessness in his work even now he's been knocked <laughs> Ben's head back with so unable to pin him so far and uh, he found a little bit Not that we're particularly concerned about points verdicts at this stage of the game, but there's three American judges. There's bravery about him. Well, Ben's point. On there, Jim, they're both having a bit of respect. A good pace, I mean, it's had a good burst in the fight. Hoping that uh, Ben will run out. Both throwing good shots. You hear the timekeeper knocking there to warn the seconds around. Pressuring him the whole time and hitting. Oh, what punches they are, Jim. Is this the, the first rock of a landslide now coming in from Ben? It looks like it. Well, the credit shot. <laughs> so he really shouldn't be. Oh, no, it's good stuff. And before that. But he has clicked. to Rob Douglas. Forward for any time to now. He'd be more than pleased to get such a clear points decision anyway, but there's still plenty of time. Tommy Gallagher, that is. So the <laughs> making him pay to wit. you just grab But uh, the wit still had a bang on the chin from Ben. The trainers call it this. Strong as anything. Oh, tremendous shot. I'm sure he can't. Well, I said he could have fooled me. Ben looked as though he twisted his knee or something there, Reg. Yeah, yeah he did. I couldn't work that one. Just keeping Ben controlled more fighting. Oh, a good shot. Punch. I don't think he's going to get up from that, he says Randy Newman, and of course Red. the witness says yes, but it's all over, bar the shouting, Jim. More control and it'll all be over. Yes, that's it. It's all over. Third knockdown. And if I want to recognise this or not, I don't know. But let's see the finish, Jim, again. Well, that was the left hook. That was the one. Ben Hilton, but he uh, hadn't... And there it is again, a real close-up job there. The the uppercut came up. He allowed it to go to the third knockdown rage because DeWitt obviously had nothing left. He hadn't really had a good round all the way through the fight. The referee for me could have called it off after the... He thought I would...